name is Deception, and this is The Good, The Bad, or The Ugly. A show that takes indie games and put them head to head to see which one is good, bad, or ugly. You are now, now rocking with Mega Faggot Robo Bitch. Hello, my name is Deception, and today we are doing our good, bad, or ugly stuff. This first game is called Wayward. Um, the description is, or at least like the story behind it or whatever. Embark on an everyday journey to school on this top-down pixel art RPG adventure. This game is super cute, super adorable. I really enjoyed playing it. Um, it's kind of short actually, which was kind of a letdown because this game actually leaves you wanting more, which is a good thing to have in an indie game. So I'll let you guys see the gameplay. Bye. Wayward. Let's get it. <coughs> Weather forecast. Looks like we'll be having strong winds ahead coming from the east, folks. Press E to continue. Be careful if you're venturing out and make sure to always stay on the path. TV switches off. Good mum. Mum. Goodness gracious. Looks at the look at these horrendous grades. Your teacher also wrote that you've been late to every class so far. Dad. Dot dot dot. You should get going now. School starts in one hour. You better not be late this time, or else we'll be very disappointed in you, young sir. Okay. I got this. I just need to be at school by 8.30. Okay, so we say we got this, but what an adventure we're on. I don't, this is cute. I'm, I'm enjoying this. Oh, but look, look at, look at the, look at the fishing rod. Let's go over there and play on the, with the fish. Let's go swimming. God bless, shut the hell up. You're so loud. Broken, ma, why is it? Oh God, oh Lord. Oh, you're gonna blow me into the water. Wait, am I going the right way? I'm gonna be going the right way. Oh no, oh gosh, I'm gonna be late to school. I'm gonna be late to school. No, the water, the water. Someone needs to help me. I'm going to die in the water. Y'all need to, oh, oh no. Oh, okay, okay, we're fine. Well, shit. Okay, I guess we're gonna have to go back then. I figured that was gonna be the end of it, honest. No, oh, no, 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 no. Okay, well, we don't have a life. Like three hearts and you're dead kind of thing. Ah, 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 ah. Someone needs to help me. I'm like a little balloon I'm just gonna fly away in the wind oh god oh gosh oh no oh good lord you're late I'm sorry make sure you're not late tomorrow I'm sorry the wind was so hefty just just pushing me all around the place can't believe you were late today mom you had no idea the wind it was like a tornado I'm so I fell in the water twice you really need to clean up your act I fell in the water bitch you haven't messed around you wouldn't be late yeah I would have been late cuz the wind so strong blew me everywhere okay I got this it's 30. Okay, cool. Do I have a dash button? I need a dash button because I'm not moving very quickly. Oh my god, it's the wind. Oh my god, it's the wind again. I go, oh, oh, ha, ha, I just defied gravity. Why do we need to live in a place that you need to walk a freaking boardwalk for me to get to school? Oh dear, what shall I do now? Oh no. Hello there, dearie. I need, is it the timer going? No, thank God I can read slowly. I need to collect mushrooms on the field to the north, but the wind is very strong. Oh, I know, can you help me pick them? I don't have a reward to offer you for your troubles, but I'll make, you'll make it, me a very happy old lady. No, I gotta get to school, motherfucker. School is way more important than helping you. Phew, I made it on time. You know, the old lady can swim or whatever. So you the teacher called today. They're very happy with your performance. They also mentioned that you came earlier than any of your classmates. We're so proud of you at the tree. Your dad will bring bringing you out to fish later. Oh, I don't know how this turns southern. Uh, before I forget, can you two help me deliver this porridge to the neighbor lady? I heard poor granny tripped and caught a fever earlier trying to gather mushrooms. That wasn't my fault. Hey, she didn't have to get mushrooms, bruh. That is not that is not a me thing. Was that the end of it? Okay, let's do it again, but this time help the old lady. No one cares, shut up. Okay, I got this. Okay, so wait, 830 cools. Oh, the wind, oh, the wind, oh, the wind. Mom, I need, I need some weighted shoes because this wind is killing me, small. Da, 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 I made it too really early this time. I made it. Yes, I did, because I'm a, what you call a pro walker, but walking since the day that I was two years old, or less, probably. People used to start walking like six months, right? I don't know. Good job, made school on time today. Make sure you keep it tomorrow. And no dilly dallying. Sure, whatever, make it school right there. I'm not, because I'm gonna help a lady pick out some shrooms. Try, she trying to get really high. This actually helps. Go figure the wind actually kind of helped me for once. Oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh, quit it. Oh dear, whatever shall I do now? Hello dear, we blah, blah, make me happy lady. What you pick for me, yeah? Sure, whatever. Who needs an education when you can help old people, right? Oh, no, 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 no. The damn wind. It's the wind. It's the wind. That's God bless it. Stuff the mushrooms into your pocket. Cool. Oh, gosh. Don't help me out too much, wind. 
Don't help me out too much, Wynn. Don't help me out too much. Oh my god. Got to calm your titties. Chill them out on ice. Chill them out on ice. Thank you. I want this fucking wind to stop. It's not gonna stop. Okay. You're welcome, ma'am. You have a nice day. I'm gonna try and fight this wind to get to school all very late. An hour late. Cool. Your teacher called today. They're very upset. You were late. I can't believe you didn't try to reach school in time. Right at this point, you're grounded. Don't even bother leaving your room until you're done with all your assignments. And you reach your room. You got the window to see, and you see the granny. She spots you through the window where she gives you a small smile. Well, at least you helped someone else today, baby. All right. I do wish there were more, like, um, things that you could do with your time. I wish there was more consequences, I guess. Like, different story mode. Like, okay, day seven, you know, if you don't get to school on time, then you're grounded or whatever, or, or it gets bad. Um, I wish the dad would have been like, this is more storyline stuff now. I wish the dad would have been on the side of like, oh, yeah, well, um, your mom may think she's mad at you or whatever, but I heard you helped the old lady, and I'm really happy about that and proud of you. I thought that could have been an extra thing to kind of make the story more rich. But overall, it's totally fine as it is. It's cute. Um, the graphics look amazing. Very solid game. I really enjoy it. If this is a good, bad, or ugly, this is definitely, definitely a good game. I will definitely give this one a higher rating for this day. Now let us move on to the next game. Whoa. As you guys can see here, this game is called Wholesome Cats. It's extremely cute, extremely adorable. It's a turn-style based RPG involving adorable little kittos. And uh, yeah, I actually really, really enjoy this game. This game has a lot more story than the last game, but I'll let you guys see it in the gameplay. Bye. Oh, hello. Don't mind the bread. I don't mind at all. Oh my gosh, cute. Welcome to Half Moon Island, an island of wholesome cats. Here's one meow coin. I'll take it. Now you can adopt a cat from the shop. Oh my god, I could totally see myself just playing this for no reason. Oh, it's so cute. Oh my god, I got a limp tap cat. Oh my god, it's so precious. Now you can add that to your cat team. Where's my where's my cat team right here? What do I need a team for? Are y'all gonna fight like little Pokemon? Is this like cat Pokemon? Oh my God, I'm gonna have a panic attack. <gasps> In a good way though. Now your team can explore Moon Island and rescue us from our past. Oh Jesus Christ. Here's fish bone and meow coins to support your journey i'll see you soon okay you fat little turd i'll see you later you're mommy of my cat who's also a fat little turd he doesn't have bread on his face though home sweet home play please oh my god this is so in depth Do i have to read more shit fuck all right type of cat ah uh, hello ah uh, hello young cats i've never seen you before are you new here Yes, we just moved in. Ah, welcome to Half Moon Island. All in full of kind and energetic little meowers. The cats love to play fight. Speaking of, wanna play with us? Oh my god, it's a full on RPG with little meow meows. Holy shit. Nice fight. Minus four, suck it, you little turd. I know the places are scary, but you'll fit right in with the others. Is that what the mean? What the fuck? This is remind me of like Undertale seems appeased by my meow minus seven. Oh my god that meow is hefty attack i can't meow anymore yay i had fun i should warn you hush don't scare away the new cats what i've gotta go take a nap now but i'm sure you'll fit right in the island bye what i have to do all this in my own home motherfucker this is ridiculous ah hi how are you my name's persian i mean you got one of those faces that tells me you a persian a Persian pussy. You're those new cats I've heard. You're the, oh, I'm a cat too? Oh, fuck yeah, that's two cat gays in a row where I've been a cat two days. Am I officially a Nico? Disgusting! I've heard about, have they told you? Told me what? The history of the island? That's not, I guess not. You'll find out too. You'll find out why it, there's a gloom over all the cats. Why we're lonelier than before. Oh no, how can I cheer you up? Play, fight me, bitch. Fight me. I think I like that. Fight me. Fight, fight, fight. Kiss, kiss, kiss. Meow. It's gonna be okay. I guess. Oh, it seems nicer towards the tabby cat. Ha! Take it. Take it with stride, you little shit. You lost. How does my attack miss? Ugh. No cat seems happy anymore. Quit being so depressed. Oh my god, the derpy face. Derpy face. Young cat. Time I tell you the history, the island's history. Cats used to be less sad, you know? Really? We may look happy, but we're haunted by Pat. By the past. Poof, poof, poof. I'll tell you a story. Many moons ago, there were three types of cats. The Pegasi, the Earth Ponies, and the Unicorns. Live cats, mundane cats, and Earth cats. You know, I swear to Glog, that's exactly what I just said. We lived in harmony. 
But the mundane, is that supposed to say mundane? Man-made, jeez, I can't fucking read. Man-made cats got greedy for power. They fought and drove out the life cats from Half Moon Island. No one's seen any life since. We're all dead then, we're all ghosts? Holy shit, we're ghost cats. That makes it better. I don't wanna think about the past anymore. Let's fight each other. I don't know. Uh, I probably should wait to use that later. Fight, 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 fight. Kill him, kill him, kill him. I know, I know. If only some cat could bring the life cats back. Who would be strong enough to do it? Seems appeased by me. I didn't want to use it on him. He's already out. Quit missing. Why? Why did you keep on missing? Wait, hang on. Do I have another cat? What? I didn't know I had another cat. Oh my gosh. Why didn't I add this cat to my team? I didn't know that. Shit. Skip it. I already know. I already know. I want to hug you. Give us good and fluffy hug. There, there, Marvin. The life cats will come back somehow. Thank Mew. <laughs> You're quite the hugger, you know? Ah, I've been stressing over life for so long. I feel better now. Old Marvin seems satisfied with brown cat's hug. Many had a search for where the live cats were, but failed. Bef hey, maybe Mew be. Cat jokes, you could succeed. Me? Question mark? That's a great idea. This cat seems strong and determined. No one knows who they are. They could find and convince the live cats to come back. What do you think? I'll try my very best to bring them back. Hell yes. Vi wow, that was all I needed? I can convince you with love. Let me love you and you will feel happy. Uh, are you leaving the house? Old, Ma Old man Marvin told us you're going on an adventure. Adventure to Capital City. Dangerous out there. Hey, I'm off on a journey. Thank you for worrying. I trust you know what you're doing, but be careful. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm not an adventurer. I'm just a cat that moved in literally 20 minutes ago. But here we are going off on an adventure. Let's have one last battle. I mean, play around. I mean, kill each other. I mean, scratch those eyes out. I mean, hiss. I don't know. Make sure you're ready for the outside world. How do I, how do I keep missing? Meow, I'll be fine. I can't help but worry. It seems tender towards that meow meant minus seven. I'll miss you on our journey through the island. Ah, oh, jeez, you too. Ah, oh, jeez, Rick. How do I keep missing? Oh, why? Oh my lord. I don't, I don't, I don't got. I can level up? Oh my god. 14 fish? Yes. I'm gonna level that boy up. It's so cute. My heart is like, yes. Meow, I feel stronger. I gotta get this game go. This game is freaking great. Like, I mean, good lord, good, bad, or ugly. This game is great. Like, this is this is so much better than good. I mean, there was one little thing where it wasn't always like reacting in the fight scenes to the cat that I wanted to attack. But other than that, storyline's cute, the cartoon's cute, the animation's cute, all the game is consistent, it sounds great, it looks great. It's just one of those things where it's like, oh, I could just play this for like hours and I wouldn't even know that I've been playing it for that long. And that was that's what's scary about it. It's like one of those kinds of games. So if you guys want to play this game, it's in the description and I'm going on to the next game. Wow. All right, y'all. Y'all are probably, that was probably loud as shit. I'm sorry. This game is called This Is Your Life Now. Um, it's a game, the description says, get through a whole life under five minutes, make tough choices and suffer their consequences. From baby to old person, you'll get to live something unique. Maybe you'll find the meaning of life. I don't know about you guys, but I didn't find the meaning of life in an indie game. At least not today. Um, it was actually really fast. It was a lot, like I said, it was five minutes long. It was pretty fast. Um, I'll let you guys see my full review of it and I'll show you guys at the end of the video. Bye. Two out of the three have been short. Number this is fucking level one, childhood. Oh, it's a little laggy for my computer. You got your parents now. Oh, you got careless carelessness now. You got your toys now. Sibling. You've tamed a sibling. It costs your toys. That's fine. Uh, what is this? Best friend. Social. I'll just. I'm, you have obtained your best friend. Oh yeah, boy. What is this? What is this? Uh, rebel attitude. I mean, uh, I want rebel attitude. Yeah, but it's mine. It, uh, you'll never be intro intro intro. Cool, bro. I'm down for never being introvert. I want to be like. I sound like a pretty good badass. You got hope because you want to hang- Oh no! You lost carelessness- Oh my gosh. I'm confused. What is this? What it- Adolescence. Alright. I'm, I'm making my way downtown. Jumping high, making sure I don't cry. Do, 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 do. Uh, good grades. You're going somewhere. Versus fun. Oh. Well, I want- I want good grades. Oh, it cost your best friend. You'll never get fun. Oh! 
That's not fair. Group of friends. Um, sure, but does it cost my good grade? No, it doesn't. Okay, good, 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 good. I'm my best friend, though. Oh, I need my first love. Oh, yeah. Oh, but it costs my good grades, though. Ah, damn it. I, I mean, love is so important. Minor addiction. Jesus Christ. You're making things dramatic as hell. Uh, what is this? A nerdy person versus being a talented... A talent for sports? Uh, you'll never be... You'll never get a nerdy passion. I mean, maybe that was not a good... I think I like nerdy stuff. You lost your first love, but all the good things come to an end. Ah! Degree... Do that or party buddies. Um, screw it, party buddies. You'll never get a degree. Oh God, this is terrible. Oh, you just lost your group of friends, but you're moving to a... I literally picked that so that I could be like, I picked party friends or whatever so I could hang out with my friends forever. Cause I felt bad losing my best friend. Golly, adulthood. All right, what's this one? Uh, artistic career, boring job. I'm going artistic career all the way, my dude. You got... It costs you talents for you to never get a boring job. I mean, wait, why would artistic career make me sacrifice my sports thing? Oh God. No! Just lost your parents. Uh, furniture, I need some furniture, y'all. I detained furniture, furniture's important. I like my couches and my TVs. You lost your minor addiction because art is your drug now. Oh wow, house or traveling memories. I need a house, I'm sorry. You'll never get traveling memories. Damn, bro, that sucks. I hate these decisions. Is that a girl? Yep, yep. I'm gonna take that. I'm gonna take my partner with me. You lost your hope. Oh, because we're all gonna die. Fuck you. Nah, I don't. I don't. I don't need an expensive car. You lost your sibling, but because you don't see each other anymore. I don't know how to fix that. What? Artistic career because people don't like. Oh my gosh. I ain't picking up problems. You lost your furniture because it all burned in a fire. Good lord. You got a kid now because maybe it's not all that bad. Freedom. Run away from all your problems. Screw it. We're saying screw it to everybody. We're literally losing everybody and everything. We're saying screw it. Old age. Oh my God, all my shit's gone. I look old as hell. <laughs> look at me, I'm an old jelly bean, ain't I? Gonna make it there, guys. We gonna get there, come on. Where's my next thing? Death, I'll just die. I'll just say fuck it and just die. It's great, it's a great idea. There's literally like nothing here. Oh, okay, here we go. Are you the end? Inner peace. Yep, you got death now because your time is up. So I got a bunch of stuff. All right, let's. This is it. Let's go die. You were born. You got parents, you got carelessness, got your toys, got your siblings, lost your toys. This is your life. You could have done better. Fuck you. You don't know anything about better life. Try a new life. Uh, let's go ahead and try it one more time. I got my parents. Do I want a sibling? No, I don't want a sibling because they hold me back. You got nightmares because you don't have a brother or sister to protect you. Oh shit, that wasn't what I want. Best friend. We'll take a best friend though. We'll do. We'll definitely take a best friend with us. See if we can get a best friend forever to stay. Uh, rebel attitude or nah, bro. We're gonna take our rebel attitude as always. Gonna keep it with us. We're gonna lose it though probably when we have that boring job in the future because I want to switch it over. You lost carelessness because you're growing up. How did I- Adolescent. Ooh. Lost your toys because you're too that now. Aw, man. What is this? Uh, good grades or fun? We're gonna take good grades again. Don't keep the nerdy attitude though. Gosh, best friend, but you'll never get fun. What is this? A group of friends? No, we don't need that. We're s we're gonna be completely a loner. We'll take our first love though. Damn it! I should just live a completely solo life. I don't really have a plan going into the second round. Nerdy attitude. You got bullies now because you got a nerdy passion, of course. Gosh, your first love, but all good things come to an end. We'll take our good grades. Degree, and you'll never get part. I didn't really choose the stuff that I need to do for this one, so I may actually redo this for like official, like a nerdy path. I wonder if I choose like nerdy path and then take art. I wonder if I'll keep that art career for a lot longer. I don't think so. Artistic career, I'm taking a boring job, gotta make a living, gotta do that thing. I will try and get a first, I'll try to get the partner thing. You got money now because that's one of the job things. Lost your parents because you never went back to visit. I need my furniture. I'm sticking by the fact that I need some mother freaking couches. And I need a house. Nerdy passion because you don't have time for that anymore. I'll take my partner with me because I need my girl by my side. Lost hope because we're all gonna die. I need my expensive car. Oh no, but it cost me my partner. Screw it, I don't want her anyways. Uh, you got an addiction now. Oh God, that's not good. Fuck it, 99 problems is fine. We'll just take it with us. You obtained 99 problems. Oh God, all my furniture is gone. I thought that if I had an expensive job, I would get like insurance or something. What is this? What are, what are you? Freedom, run away from all your boredom. Nope, that isn't the life that I want to live. 
I got 99 problems, an addiction, a mortgage, a house, lost my girlfriend, I don't have a baby, I have got nothing, I'm about to die all alone. Completely not at peace. We're not gonna get inner peace. Nothing, we're just gonna die. Damn, man, I'm losing everything. We don't want inner peace, fuck you, bye. I didn't live the crappiest life possible because I didn't get like the introvert at the very first part of it. I don't think, I think I got like the freedom or whatever. Um, okay, so this game wasn't terrible. Um, I'm not blown away by it. It kind of like builds up to a basically kind of boring ending. The way they could have avoided that was having multiple endings. And like, if you got like all these different combos, you should have had like the lonely ending or like the uh, the selfish ending and like maybe 10 or 10 of them or whatever. When you kind of end out with this, you know, this is just the end of it. That was your life. You could have done better, whatever. And it kind of makes the game a little less replayable. It is interesting seeing how different effects uh, or see what you do have different effects. And that's all good and fine. That does actually help with its replay value. But I guess in the end, maybe they should update it to have multiple different endings. That way it's a lot more interesting. I mean, the other two games, I should have played this first. You know, this is really cute. This is good. I mean, the animation was good. It's a little laggy, but that could be my computer. The cartoons were good. The storyline was cute-ish. It was, it was good enough to keep me going uh, for at least two rounds. It wasn't anything that blew me away. Like, I think they put a lot of time into the graphics and the animation, which is all good and fine. And I'm so down for that. But, you know, when you don't have a, a really pleasant payoff, it kind of leaves you feeling like, all right, well, now what? Which, of course, I guess you died. What Now what is the answer to that question? If the game stays consistent to reality. But at the same time, I feel like for a video game, you want to go like a little above and beyond reality. So having different endings would have definitely made this a little more of a solid, more fulfilling game where you want to keep trying over and over and over again to get all the endings. This game was bad, but it wasn't bad as the term like it's not playable or it's not good. It was just bad in the terms that the game isn't fulfilling. So it was bad on those terms, but it was good on other terms. Um, and I just want to say for a disclaimer, because I label something bad doesn't mean it's actually a bad game. It's just, it's just how the ranking is and it's just a, it's a term for the show. So that was it guys. Hope you all have enjoyed this video of the good, bad, the ugly. Let me know what you guys think of every indie game in the description down below and I'll see you guys in the next video. I've officially been accepted. Bye!